Well, being a landlord, there's always a challenge. And this is just one of many that I've come across and fixed in the past. I thought I'd show a little video of how I go about doing these repairs. Uh, of course, we're underneath the sink here, and we had a leak, and evidently the tenant didn't know, didn't tell me, and it's just kind of made a mess at the bottom of the cabinet. It's all warped. It's still sturdy. It's not rotted out. It's still sturdy, but it's not an even surface. It just looks horrible. So I need to come up with a quick and easy way to fix this. Now, this is not so bad. Sometimes I've run into them where you know, they've just rotted completely out, so you have to take it out completely, put in some two by fours to get a, a new level surface, 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 surface. There we go. It's two o'clock in the morning. I'm a little tired. So anyways, so the way I go about doing this, having rental property, I'm always putting down flooring and different stuff. So I always keep some leftover pieces. So what I got down here is leftover uh, uh, planks. Uh, what is it called? Um, uh, leftover laminate flooring. That's what I'm trying to, trying to get out. So what makes this nice is, otherwise it, you know, you really can't cut one big piece of plywood, or you could maybe cut it in half and try to put it in, in here. But because of the way this is ton of roof and made in sections, it makes it quite easy to install. I'm going to try to do this with one hand. We'll see if I'm successful at it. So we've got one piece back there. All right, let's try to get another piece. Pull my mouth just right. Okay. Tongue and groove. Get it set. Come on. Get it even. Okay. There's piece number two. And for the third and final piece. There we go. All done. Quick and easy, and so now there's another option too. If you have, if you happen to have leftover vinyl planking, now if you don't have this stuff, go to your local carpet store. Usually they have uh, pieces that's left over from a job where the ends have got chipped or whatever. Let, let them know what you're doing. They'll probably give it to you. Probably look in their dumpster. They probably got they throw out extra pieces in, in their dumpster if you want to do some dumpster diving. But it's a quick and easy fix. Looks really good. Of course, you you always want to find the leak and take care of that too. So I got that on my list. Anyway, there's a quick and easy fix when your kitchen cabinet gets all rotted out and looks bad for you. Thanks for watching and have a great day.